So here's the current progress on my planet loader. So yeah, it's loading from a height map onto a sphere. Well actually it's a cube technically, which has been normalized to make a quad sphere. But the problem is that I have at the moment is that if I want to apply a quad tree to this, it isn't going to work because I'm using a sphere map. So I've currently got two versions of this. I've got a one that loads a cube map and one that loads a sphere map. Now the problem I'm having is if I use this sphere map, I'm not going to be able to get a quad tree in, which means when I zoom in like this, it's not going to get that detail. And as you can see, that that's problematic. So if I can manage to tile the pearl in noise to make it available to be used as a cube map, then I will switch back to that. I'll, I'll give you some video footage of that planet as well. But it does look quite good, I think, after trying for a long time. This has been done with the libnoise library for the pearl in noise, but on the cube mapped version, I am using a GLSL function that I adapted from the internet. So I'll show you that as well. So this is what the mesh looks like and it lags a lot when I view the mesh, especially when recording. And if I get in close enough, I should be able to see the, show you the corner of the cube, which I can't seem to find, which is pretty good actually. I don't want to be able to find it. Um, I think it's around about here. Ah yes, it's just here. So you can kind of see it a bit there actually, and then it goes up there. Each one of these is a quad with a sphere mapped around it. So now I will go and show you the other one. So I will just close this and open that. Okay, so here's the quad sphere with a cube map. And the problem is, I, I just mapped this simple texture onto it for now, so you can see. But at the edges of the cubes, the quads, you can clearly see where it, a new quad starts and that's a major problem at the moment unless I can get tileable pearl in noise in well I have tileable pearl in noise but I can't get into a cube map shape so I can't do that right now when I work it out it should look great um, this one's using the code in the shader to generate the noise so it's not in the shape of a awesome planet yet but you can see that there's clearly like distortions made from the pearl and noise. So when I adapt that to actually make a nice shape of a planet, it will look good. And all I have to do is just get add some more octaves to the pearl and noise and do some other things in the shader to make it look good. So this has the same shape. On the inside it seems you can see the quads a lot more. It doesn't look spherical at all. But I assure you, it is completely spherical. So yeah, I'm going to do some more work on it, and it should turn out pretty well, hopefully. But we'll see. Thanks for watching.